Pumpkins Nail Station. Um, today I'm just going to show you these um, drill piece sets, what I got from Melody Susie for review. Um, these came in a bag. Uh, they came bagged in this. Oh, it was all neatly bagged and all like that with a Melody Susie sticker on it. But I've taken it out because it was really stiff. So these are the um, carbide rainbow bits. Gorgeous, gorgeous bits. And this is the ceramic set. And they also do another ceramic set, which I'm going to stick a picture up of, which is a little bit cheaper than this one. This is a seven piece set. This is £29.99. Um, no, £28.99. I think this one was £29.99. I'll put the prices on the screen in the links below anyway. I can't remember off the top of my head. Um, but I'm going to put my other ceramic set in here because this one came in a beautiful holder where you can add more bits in it. So I'm going to add all my ceramic bits into here. I think that's what I'm going to do until I get another holder. But I wouldn't mind getting another one of these because they're a lot smaller and they will fit into my um, container that I've got rather than one of those round things because I don't think I've got room on my desk for something else. So that's what I might have to look for, something like that. So we'll go through the bits first off. We'll go through the carbide bits. So this one is a 332 inch, whatever that means. And it's a umbrella in fine. So I would use this under here to smooth out there. Or if I had any smoothing out up here, maybe you could use it there as well. That's what I would use it for, but I'll tell you what the, I'll stick some images up um, of what the company say these bits are for. <laughs> uh, you get one of these, that's for cleaning the dust off. Um, a torch cylinder, medium. So this is for removing product, basically. Uh, for removing your product. And it's cut really well. I don't know if you can see this, but these look really well made. Right, I've got some um, that are nice bits, but I think they look a bit scruffy below, you know, because this is how they came. Uh, this one that's a little bit more worse than that one that came with all solder all underneath here. I think it's probably quite normal. These bits are Wilson bits. They are really good bits, and don't let that bottom bit put you off because they are really really good bits and i got those from aliexpress but what i'm saying to you is these bits don't have all that they've been really well put together so they look really nice quality um and we're going to put them to the, a couple of them to the test anyway today to remove this um manicure because i'm going to re-polish this one is a large barrel medium again gorgeous so yeah, I really, really like that. So it feels really well cut. It looks like it would cut both ways as well, but we'll test that out if they're left and right. This one is a medium barrel ball. If anybody can tell me what this is for, I'm going to have to look what this is for. I've never seen it, but it's probably for removing product. But again, it looks like it would cut both ways. It doesn't look like it's cut in one direction. But we'll go and we'll test it. This one is the large barrel, which is fine, which is for smoothing. So I really wanted one of these. It's for smoothing down the nail after you've filed. I think and buffed, you can smooth it out. Um, so you can just add your top coat on if you want or whatever. Um, and this one is a torch cylinder medium, so it's a bit bigger than the first one that I showed you. Where is it? It's smaller than the other torch one. Where is it? So this one's a torch and this one's a torch. And then this one's a very similar pattern as well, but they're just all different sizes. That one is just a smaller version of that one, I think. And again, you could use it for in here. I don't know if it'd go under there. I'm going to have to play with these and see because I'm new to all these. There's so many drill bits that you can get and 
But I think this kit is basically for removing product, removing gel, for smoothing your nails, for going underneath your nails. So you've got a bit for everything in that kit basically. I think that's how it's been put together. Um, this one. I'll get out the... Um, I'll just go and get my phone and we'll see what these bits are for. So I'll be back in a minute. Okay, right, so I'm back. But I'll insert these pictures anyway for you. Um, so this piece here... Just try and get them out. This piece here, it says, easy to trim the edge of the cuticle or go underneath the nail. So it can be used to trim around here. Like underneath there get the skin off your nails and this feels really really fine so this could be I think this could be used on your natural nails and on on um, enhancements as well it does feel smooth enough to go onto your natural nails it doesn't feel rough like some of the cuticle bits do um, and it's really good for going underneath here so that's what I would use that bit for anyway mainly okay um. So we've got this bit next. So this blue barrel top is to polish and reshape the nails. So it's for polishing and reshaping the nails. That's what it says. So you can reshape like using your drill. So you can reduce length, reshape and you can polish with it and remove product I presume. That's what it's saying. So it's got a safety bit on the end as well. And you've got two types of bits one that's like that with the round top which means you can get close to the cuticle without cutting yourself um, and this one isn't so you have to be more careful it does get closer up but it can cut the skin to so keep that in mind so what the next one says so the next one is the green one um, it's for removing product basically, it's a coarse grip bit. So that's that bit there. So this red one here, these are torch cylinder bits. The fine and medium. So I think the red is fine, the blue is medium. And it says to easily polish, reshape nail reach small tight areas without scratching the nails great for infill and cuticle work so it's you can remove your product and smooth off the nail with these as well so and then So yeah, they just, I'll pop these bits, pictures in anyway, and then they get a brush for cleaning the nails. Um, and then you get this one as well, which is for the cuticle area. And again, this doesn't feel rough at all. I would use this on my cuticles. It feels really, really fine. It's not damaging my skin. It's not hurting my skin. It's not pulling on my skin. I'm not getting anything from that. It's not, it's not scratching that nail. It's not scratching it. It's yeah. This would be fine to use on your own nails. Some say not to use ceramic bits on them, but these actually do feel really, really nice and fine and smooth. So I don't know. I think I would just very quickly, briefly, to do cuticle work. Um, so that is both of the sets there. Um, and what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to quickly um, test one of each out or something, one ceramic bit and one of these carbide bits um, just to remove um, some gel polish from a couple of nails. So I'm just going to get my dust collector and then I'll be back in a minute. Okay, right, so we're back. So instead of taking it off my nails, I'm going to put it to the test on this tip that I sculpted. So we'll try and take off some gel polish and then with the ceramic bits we'll reduce some length. So we'll see how that goes. So I think I'm going to try this large barrel bit for removing the gel. And we're going to use the Melody Susie e-file to 
watch the unboxing on that watch it um, in the top right so you pop your bits in there and you twist it to the right to lock it and to the left to unlock it and I'm just going to turn the volume down now um, so I'm just going to turn this up to about 15 and I'm going to remove the gel I'm going to try a different bit now, so that bit was working really well. I've got about three layers of gel polish on here, so it is pretty thick. So now we'll try uh, this ball barrel bit, so we'll see how that goes. So that bit removed the gel really, really quickly, um, the ball barrel part, that removed it much faster, I noticed, so take from that what you will. So probably the other bits are more uh, gentle movement, so is this one, um, but if you want to take away a bulk quickly then the barrel bit seem to work really well. Um, so now I'm going to try something to reduce the length. So let's try this green one. 
So I'm going to try this green ceramic bit. And just want to say this e-file, when I'm putting pressure on it, it doesn't seem to stop the spinning. Like the torque in this is really, really good. It's not, it's not stopping, it's not skipping. I'm not losing any there's no there's not like a strange sound difference or anything like that it's not under pressure and that's only at about just under 15,000 rpm impressed this this removes bulk effortlessly and you saw how it just cut straight through that and that was below 15,000 rpms and it had no problems at all cutting through that thick fairly thick poly gel well a regular sort of length poly gel and it removed bulk effortlessly really quickly and it feels quite smooth so yeah yeah I'm in pressed. I've only got a little bit of dust on my hands at the moment. There's nothing on me. It seems to be on the part of the dust machine as well, um, where I was working. So yeah, I'm I am impressed with these bits and this e-file. I must say, I am very very impressed with it. So I think that'll be it really just for today. Just a quick demo to show you this in action. I didn't want it to be too long. Um, but I'm going to do another video where I'm removing my gel polish with some of these bits. So there'll be a part two to this. Um, but that's, that's the demo of me using one of the ceramic bits and a few of the carbide bits. And you've seen them in action and they work really well. Um, so yeah, I am... I am impressed, I have to say. I have to say I'm impressed. Very impressed. I have to say that I am. I am really, 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 really impressed with this e-file. I love it. Absolutely love it. I think it's worth the money it's only 50 pounds and at the moment um i want to say something melody susie have offered me a discount code if you buy uh i think it's a, a carbide drill bit set it may be for these as well i'll confirm it and write it in the description box but if you buy this definitely buy the carbide drill bit set and this e-file that i've got here the scarlet one they'll offer you a discount on both of them so I'll pop the information about that in the description box with the code number and link um, and how much it's for. I think it's 10% or it may be a little bit more, I can't remember. Um, but it'll all be below anyway. Um, but they're offering a discount if you buy both of them together. Um, only because um, the Melody Suzy file is already at a low price. I think it might be an introductory price. I'm not sure if it's going to go up in the future but i think it's just a price what they've put on it to introduce it i think so i think it's already at its cheapest price it can be on its own so they've offered a discount if you buy the bits as well um so yeah all that information will be below um so that is it that is it for today uh, watch the part two where i remove the gel polish using these bits and that is it for today so yeah big thumbs up <laughs> for melody susie <laughs> 
yeah yeah really i can't fault the c-file at all all the bits i think they're both they're all really nice quality they look high quality to look at them um in comparison to that green one and a cheap one that i've got there is a massive difference like the um teeth are on the cheap ones just look like they will just scratch i may do a video comparing them if i can find any more of the cheap bits that i brought um, but that is it for today anyway so thanks for watching and have a great day bye